The Member of Parliament for Shugonis East, Fazal Karim, wants to know what the government has against the Pinal Debe campus of the University of the West Indies. During his contribution to the budget debate, the former Minister of Tertiary Education said when the People's Partnership government left office, the campus was 80% complete. He said in fiscal 2016, government did not spend $33.4 million of the allocated funding. In 2016, in 2016, $43 million was allocated by the Honorable Minister of Finance for the completion of the UE Penal Labor Campus. Madam Speaker, you won't believe, and I want this to be recorded for the national community to know that out of an allocation in 2016 of $43 million, they only spent $9.6 million. MP Karim debunked the theory that the Penal Debe campus was only to be used as a law faculty. He said there's a need for the Penal Debe campus as a high percentage of UE students live in South Trinidad. And that survey found that 67% said a campus should be established in South Trinidad. 67%. What year? What year? 2007. Madam Speaker, I want to tell you, for those who do not know, the concept for those who would want to argue against the University of the West Indies, having a facility in South Trinidad, the concept is no different to what happened in Jamaica.